improving usability and maintaining performance. Human Factor and Aerosol Performance Studies evaluating the new reusable Respimat inhaler. The Respimat is a handheld, propellant-free, softness inhaler. It actively generates a slow-moving aerosol that does not depend on the patient's inspiratory effort. It delivers a high, fine particle fraction, resulting in efficient drug delivery. Observations and feedback from patients and physicians prompted development of an improved second-generation version of the Respimat. In this updated version, usability has been improved while preserving aerosol performance and daily handling steps. Reusability with multiple cartridges has also been added. To achieve this, only a few secondary components of the disposable Respimat inhaler had to be modified or added. The device lock, previously attached to the inhaler, was adapted to a cartridge lock and a reversible device lock. The dose indicator was transferred to the cartridge and made more prominent, easy to read, and displays the actuations remaining in the cartridge using both color and a numerical display. The new cartridge lock is triggered by the dose indicator reaching the last actuation. This activates the device lock to prevent further use of the device with this used up cartridge. It also opens the safety catch and pushes the clear base off, an additional safety feature so that the patient gets a clear signal to exchange the cartridge. The device lock is deactivated with insertion of a new cartridge. The clear base was modified to accommodate the improved dose indicator. A simple memory aid on the back label helps to keep track of the number of cartridges used. One circle is ticked each time a new cartridge is inserted. After use with six cartridges, the device should be discarded. Studies were performed to iteratively assess and improve usability of the new design and to assess any possible impact of the reusable Respimat inhaler design on aerosol performance. Usability was tested in three studies, measuring performance of handling tasks and collecting subjective feedback directly related to the inhaler's new or altered features, which fed into optimization of the inhaler. Overall, each handling step and each cartridge exchange feature was rated in favor of the reusable Respimat. Specifically, in patients with prior experience of the Respimat inhaler, the majority of responders found the cartridge insertion process with the reusable inhaler easier than with the disposable inhaler. The majority of respondents also considered the reusable Respimat dose indicator to be clearly better than the one in the disposable Respimat inhaler. Patients also found the clear base detachment mechanism easy to understand, practical and intuitive. Finally, regarding the level of ease of exchanging a refill cartridge, participants found all steps to replace a cartridge easy to very easy. In particular, the larger clear base and modified base of the cartridge were described as improving grip when turning or removing the clear base and when removing the cartridge. The delivered dose and fine particle dose of the reusable Respimat inhaler across multiple cartridges and the disposable Respimat inhaler were determined by laser diffraction and with an Anderson cascade impactor. Delivered dose of the Oladaterol and Teotropium components with 10 reusable inhalers over 9 cartridges each was both stable and consistent with the reference disposable inhaler. The delivered particle size distribution was also consistent and comparable between the reusable inhaler and the reference disposable inhaler. The new reusable Respimat Soft Mist Inhaler includes enhanced features that simplify its assembly and improve handling and ease of use. Drug delivery across multiple cartridges is consistent with the disposable Respimat. The reusable Respimat provides greater convenience for patients maintaining the same aerosol performance versus the disposable inhaler with a reduced environmental impact.